Hello everyone and welcome to this video. In this video we're going to perform a moderation where we're going to use depression as our outcome variable and then uh, we're going to use um, simplicity as our x variable, our predictor, and fatalism as our moderator. So we're going to click on analyze and we're going to use process for this. So I'm going to go to regression and then process version 4.0. Click there. Um, so our outcome variable is depression right here a little bug right here um, and we're going to use simplicity as our x variable and fatalism as our moderator variable over here uh, we're going to keep model one which is a simple moderation um, and um, we're going to go over here with long variable names because uh, our variable names are a little bit long here. So we'll check that we accept the risk of incorrect output. And we're going to click on options afterwards. Um, and there are a number of options we could choose from. But for example, here, uh, one thing we could do is to plot the moderation using uh, the pick a point approach. Um, and to um, interpret it using uh, various values of um, the moderator. So we're going to choose minus one standard deviation, the mean, and plus one standard deviation, which uh, tends to be uh, more usual. Uh, we're going to only keep uh, three decimal places and, um, and generate code for visualizing the interaction. Um, that's it. We're going to then click on continue. OK. Wait a bit, it's running. Okay. So, um, what do we have in terms of output? So here we have uh, the model uh, summary with uh, the R square over here, an F test of overall model fit, but this does not test the interaction effect. Uh, this is an omnibus test. It tests all of the uh, effects, all of the slopes, so these three effects, not the intercept. So this is the intercept. Here we have the effect of simplicity, the main effect of simplicity, main effect of fatalism. And here, uh, the interaction effect, we see that it is significant with this p-value over here of 0.004, so it's below 0 0.05. We, uh, in this case, it's also consistent with uh, the F-test. Um, so that's why we have the same uh, p-value over here as the p-value we have over here. So here we have a significant interaction. And the way we would interpret it is we would look at conditional fx. So here we fix fatalism uh, to uh, different values. It's our moderator. We fix it to 0 0.5, 1, and 1.5. In this case, that is because these correspond to the mean minus 1 standard deviation, the mean, and the mean plus 1 standard deviation. And so what we see here is not the effect of fatalism, but the effects of simplicity at different levels of fatalism. So what we see is that these effects are always positive, but we see that they are weaker and weaker, so they decrease here, which is uh, also uh, which also can be seen by the fact that this here is negative. So um, what we see here is a, a decrease in the magnitude of the effect of uh, simplicity on depression as fatalism uh, increases. Um, and so we could uh, plot this uh, for interpretation. Um, these are conditional uh, effects. We could plot these uh, by using the syntax over here. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to double click there so that I can select this text. And I'm going to select this whole thing over here. I will copy that. Oh, it won't let me, but I'm going to use um, Command C for that. And, um, or maybe I could use this, right? Um, and, um, and so then I'm going to uh, create a new syntax uh, with file, new syntax. Okay. And I'm going to paste the syntax that has been generated. And I'm going to select this whole syntax and click Run over here. Uh, 
And once I do this, I have um, a graph that's uh, ready for plotting. So it has plotted a number of points. The only thing I need to do now is create a line um, to show uh, um, these um, conditional effects. So I'm going to double click on this. And I will add here um, to this plot uh, regression lines for each, um, each one of the categories of points, so each one of the values of the moderator. So I'm going to click there. And right here, I can remove the label, perhaps. OK. And now I have my three effects. So you see that as fatalism increases, so go from here the blue to um, the green and then the purple, so as fatalism increases, I have an attenuated um, relation between simplicity and depression with a, a more um, a flatter uh, line over here. So that would be uh, for the interpretation. And it is, in fact, uh, here, a significant uh, interaction. That's it. Thank you for watching.